All right, what's popping, everybody? You know who it is. It's your boy, Game Info 87 from GamingRum.com. All right, guys. Um, real quick, I just want to clarify something. In my last video with Watch Dogs, I was saying that the 900p versus the 729p, it's actually 792p. So I'm sorry about that. Um, one of our writers on the side, he made a mistake. So I was reading from that. So I'm sorry about that, y'all. All right, so let's get off in the news of today. Okay. Xbox Live Gold members will be able to request a refund for remaining days after June updates. Okay, so they're going to have some updates um, in June uh, for the Xbox One. So after that, you can request a refund for the remaining days after the June updates. Okay, which is really good, guys. This is really good news. I think Microsoft is heading in the right direction with this. Okay, so listen to what they said. All right, they said that after the update, Netflix, Hulu, and other streaming apps will be free to use on the console. This is this is real good news, man. Stopping players from having to pay for both a gold membership and the subscription fees for the apps themselves. This is really good news, guys. I think Microsoft really got it now. I think they got the picture now. This is really good stuff right here, considering that they have a connectless Xbox One coming out, which I basically stated like 10 months ago that this was going to happen um, because the system is struggling and they're not selling very well at 500 bucks. So the 399 price point will be the sweet spot for them to actually, you know, start selling some units. Because if you go to a lot of retailers nowadays, if you go to Best Buy, Walmart, GameStop, you will see a bunch of Xbox One stacks up everywhere. And then you ask them about PS4 and it'd be sold out. You know, so the price is just too expensive at 500 bucks, and there's not enough games out right now. Um, the dashboard, you know, is a mess. Um, that's why they're constantly having so many updates to trying to fix it. I mean, but E3 is going to be the reviving um, thing for e, uh, for Microsoft. You know, being that Phil Spencer is the new head of Microsoft gaming division, this is real good for them, and they have a chance. Uh, to revive themselves and make something good out of this and release some very very good first party games also um, some third party games and more better features for the Xbox One and you know I'm, I'm gonna buy an Xbox One after E3 because it's $399 now and you're not forced to buy Kinect anymore you know you have an option and that's what it's all about being a consumer you want to be able to have options you know I don't want somebody to force something on me no I want to be able to have an option okay I don't have to get the expensive one I can get the cheaper one that's what it's all about in everything there should be a balance and uh, for Microsoft right now they're realizing that hey we can't just have this $500 system out like that we we have to do something because it's not selling very well considering that the whole when when they first um, announced the system you know with connect and saying that it has to work with connect and all of this stuff the whole DRM the whole 180 thing and they changed everything and when the Xbox one finally came out people was on plugging their connect and actually using the Xbox one with the connect so it's kind of like pointless because a lot of people don't like connect but nevertheless they fix all of that problem and this is some real good news like I said with the gold membership they're going to um, refund people after the June updates and you're not going to be able to um, pay for for you know the, the, the streaming service like Netflix and Hulu Plus um, it's going to be free on the consoles you know so it's going to be free on the Xbox One uh, for Netflix and Hulu and stuff like that so it, it's real it's real it's real huge man Microsoft is heading the right direction like I said all we need from Microsoft is games 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 and you know improve the dashboard um, you know more than what it is right now other than that y'all leave in the comments down below and tell me what you think if you are a Xbox Live Gold member um, so make sure that you do that make sure after the June updates um, make sure that you request a refund
for the remaining days um, that is left over after the June updates all right other than that y'all I'm going to subscribe hit the yellow button don't forget to share the video and I'm coming right back at y'all with another video all right I'm going peace <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.